Good morning, Cougars. This is episode number 21 of your CCN broadcast, and I'm Zachary. Today's top story, it's ASB election time. Are you interested in being your class president? Please come to the mandatory meeting today during break. During the meeting, you'll get more information on the election process. We look forward to meeting you today after advocacy during the break in the NPR. Good morning, Cougars. I'm Jacob. Today is Thursday, September 15th, 2022. Today is an A3 day. That means periods 3, 5, and then 1. The 9-11 service project is continuing until tomorrow. Please donate a can of food or more through your social studies class this week. Friday's, Friday's lunchtime festivities were really well done. Thank you to the music department and our history department for working together to pull off such a great event. If you missed the performances, they are up on our channel for you to check out. Well done, band, orchestra, and choir on an excellent performance. Club Rush is next week. ASB has been busy getting your tables ready, and we know everyone is excited to get involved. September 28th is Make a Picture Day for anyone that missed the first picture day. Tomorrow is our next balloon launch. Stay tuned tomorrow to see which teachers are volunteering this week. I just finished last week's balloon launch and is up on our YouTube channel. And Zachary did a great job on this one. Thanks so much to everyone involved. If you purchase tickets to the Angel Game this Saturday, they may have already been delivered to your advocacy class this week. See you at the game. Today, we have a special Thursday's Thoughts brought to us by Miss Wang. Have a great day, Cougars, and we'll see you back here tomorrow. To get to meet you, I'm going to tell you a little bit about myself. So I actually went to Evergreen Elementary. I went to Chaparral Middle School, so I'm back where I came from. And then I graduated from Diamond Bar High School. Some of the teachers here on campus were the same teachers that I had when I went to middle school. And I'm so excited to get to work with them because they were the ones who inspired me to become a teacher today. Before I came back from Chaparral Middle School or to Chaparral Middle School, I taught at West Covina High School for two years. So here's a picture of my Chaparral graduation in 2009 and then my Diamond Bar High School graduation in 2013. I do have a sister who I'm very close with and her name is Rachel. She has a dog named Ollie, and I'm obsessed with Ollie because she is so cute, and I call her my niece. I enjoy traveling. I've been to five different Asian countries and different states, so the picture on the left is when I went scuba diving in Taiwan, and the picture on the right is when I did a 10-mile bike ride around the Grand Canyon, but just because I love traveling and doing different things doesn't mean that I don't like to stay home, so I enjoy playing video games like Fortnite. I've tried Valo, but I'm not very good at it, my first impression of Chaparral, obviously the teachers are very supportive and I do enjoy being here working with them, but the students are very respectful and diligent. And that's something that I really admire about the student here. But that also brings me to the quote that I want to tell you guys about. And it's that if you don't succeed at first, try, try again. There's gonna be times when there's an obstacle or you don't succeed the first time but make sure that you don't let that stop you to get up on your feet and try it again. And that has something been something that stood by me for so long because I would not be here if I did not stand by this quote because there's so many times where I just wanted to give up where I think that it's not working, but I tried it again and I was able to get to where I am today. And then I'm here, I get the opportunity to work with every one of you guys. So make sure that you don't give up just because you did not succeed the first time. Thank you guys.